find the change in momentum and then the force exerted by the wall uh, for a ball that takes 0 0.2 seconds to bounce. So you can see here we've got um, the ball bouncing off the wall. There's a force exerted by the wall to change the direction of the ball. Um, this is obviously a vector uh, problem. So we need to find the change in momentum, as it's asked us, equals the final minus the initial. Since we can't do anything with a negative vector, we have to add, uh, or we can't take a vector away, we have to add the negative. So that's going to be the same as the final plus the negative of the initial. Okay, so our, our final is easy, that's this one up here. Um, I'm just putting the head on there to show it's a vector slightly different from here, but it, it doesn't matter. Um, and the negative of the initial is going to be, be in the opposite direction. The negative of the initial. So we just have to add it uh, top to tail. Sorry, I'm not drawing this so great, but I'm trying to hold my phone at the same time. And we can see that, remember there's a right angle here, so we'll have a right angle here. Um, you can shift the lines and get the geometry that way uh, if you like. And then our the resultant, our change in momentum is there. Um, then we can use Pythagoras to work out um, what change of momentum is, since PF is 0 0.4 and PI is 0 0.4, with 0 0.40 to two significant figures. Um, our change in momentum is the square root of uh, plus 0 0.40 squared, um, which I'm not going to work out just now, but that equals whatever it equals. And then um, once we have the change in momentum, we have to look at our impulse formula. So we have the change in time, which is 0 0.20 seconds. Um, we have the change of momentum, which we calculated from here, and you'll have to put it into your calculators to get. And we just rearrange to make F the subject. And then that will give you your final answer. And your final answer should be the two significant figures because all of the information in the question is in two significant figures. The main thing to focus on is how to do this vector section just here. Hope that's helpful.